Welcome back. So today on this lesson, I am going to show you how to take care of a plant. And the materials that you are going to need are a tray. You are going to need a water mister, or you can also use a water can. You will use a cotton ball, or you can also use a paper towel. You will need a sponge or you can also use a towel just to clean any water that drips when you are watering your plant. Okay, so here I have my plant. What do we know about plants? Well, plants are really important for the planet. In all living things, plant absorbs carbon dioxide and release oxygen from their leaves, which humans and other animals need to breathe. Living things need plants to live because they eat them and live in them. Plants help to clean water too. <gasps> wow, that's awesome. So we have to take good care of our plants because plants give us oxygen. Oxygen is the air that we breathe, and we need air to breathe and survive. So I am going to show you how to clean your leaves. Remember, we have to be very gentle when we are doing this lesson or this activity. Plants are very fragile, and we don't wanna hurt the plant. What you're gonna do is you're gonna put one hand under one of the leaves. Next, you will grab your mister or you can also um, spray to the cotton ball or wet the cotton ball and you are going to clean the leaves very gentle, very, very gentle. Or you can also spray directly to the leaf, just like that. And you will clean gently the leaf. Just like that. Okay, if you want to use your paper towel, you can spray the water to the paper towel or you can also spray to the leaf. And you will do the same thing. You will put your hand under one of the leaves and you will gently clean the leaf, just like that. Another thing that you want to do when you are doing this activity is you want to water your plant. Plants need water. They get thirsty too, just like you and me. So what you wanna do is you wanna grab your water can, or in this case, I have a cup, and I will pour a little bit of water to my plant. And I will show you. Please be gentle and do it slowly. Just like that. And now, you water your plant and you also cleaned your plant. Now, you are caring for your plant. So I hope that you do this at home and you will be helping the planet by doing so. Okay, so I hope you enjoy. Thank you. And now I would like to show you an activity that you can do at home. All you will need 
is your tray. You will need leaves like this. You can cut out your leaves and decorate your leaves however you like. You would have to make two leaves exactly the same. We are going to be matching each of the leaves. So let's go ahead and start. Here I have my leaf. Now I am going to find the leaf that's exactly the same. Is this leaf the same as this leaf? No, it's not the same. Is this leaf the same as this leaf? It's not the same. Is this leaf the same as this leaf? Yes, they are similar. They look the same. So now I have one pair. Let's try another one. Is this leaf, does this look the same? No, it's not the same. Does this leaf look like this leaf? No, it's not the same. Does this leaf look like this leaf? Yes, they are the same. Now I made my other pair and you will continue to do it for the rest of the leaves. Like this, this one is the same as this leaf and this leaf is the same as this leaf. And now I make my pairs. If you want to make it a little bit more challenging for you, you can also put the name of the leaf in a piece of paper. You will put the name of the leaf and you would have to find the leaf that matches with the name and you will put it under the leaves. That is just another challenging way you can play with this activity. So I hope that you enjoy it and you can also do it at home and be creative. And you can color your leaves however you want. Okay, so thank you for watching.